Impact stands for Individualized Movement and Physical Activity for Children Today and the, the idea of Impact is that we're able to provide individualized physical activity programs to children with unique needs and that we're having an impact on them through our services. So the Impact program began in 1982 with a faculty member called John Dunn and the goal of the program was to improve the, the health and increase the physical activity of children with disabilities. That was continued with Dr. Jeff McCubbin and it's now co-directed by three faculty including Drs. J.K. Young, Megan McDonald and myself. Uh, but the stars of the show are really the graduate students and the undergraduate students who run the program. So we have 21 graduate students who are involved with Impact every week and they oversee the program and then we have over 100 undergraduate students who work one-on-one -on -one with the students to deliver the, the activities. We have over 100 children in Impact ranging in age from 18 months to 21 years old and then we have 15 older um, young adults who are involved with Impact for Life who are working out in the community. At Impact, each child is matched one-on-one -on -one with an undergraduate student who they work through their lesson plan with. The lesson plan is written by a graduate student and it includes individualised modifications for the activities for the, each child so that they can be successful. This term I am um, partnered with Sophia and she is amazing. I see her face light up and it just gives me like, it just gives me goosebumps because I know that this is her time to have fun and like learn new things and be around kids. and and that's what I love about it. The goal of IMPACT is to get kids physically active and we had a, have a wide range of activities that kids can participate in. So typically IMPACT's broken into two sessions. The first half they'll spend 45 minutes in the pool working on swimming skills and then the other 45 minutes they'll spend in the gym working on object control motor skills such as running, kicking, throwing. One of the unique things about IMPACT is that we're able to make unique modifications for each child based on their needs. For example, we might have children with motor control or strength issues, so we're able to use different sized balls or bats that make them success successful so that they feel more confident in their abilities. One of the great things about Impact is the swimming program and what it allows for is the kids to get in the pool and work on their swimming skills and this is really unique for children in wheelchairs who are often confined to their chair who are able to get out, uh, move through specific range of motions, work on swimming skills and then a lot of that transitions to what they can do with their parents on the weekends. Brian used to be very quiet, very shy, would do no sports, would do nothing. He would just basically stand against the wall at recess and wouldn't interact with any kids. And then when we joined Impact, he started learning sports, he got confidence, he learned how to make friends, he got involved, he went back to school and started playing at recess, playing basketball, he's involved in everything, and now you can't slow him down. Now he goes nonstop. So we're so thankful to Impact and the self-confidence and the skills and the sports and everything they've given our son. Impact touches everyone who's involved with the program. The children with disabilities benefit by developing their physical activity skills and motor control. Uh, the students benefit from getting experience working with individuals with unique needs that they can then take on to their future professions. The graduate students benefit by getting practical experience running community-based programs which then they often replicate and take to their future, their future jobs. And families benefit by their children learning physical activity skills that they can then work on um, on the weekends and complete activities together as a family faculty benefit because we're able to conduct research with the program to understand how we're able to improve the physical activity skills of individuals with disabilities. Personally one of the greatest things that I enjoy about IMPACT is the number of children that we're able to serve and the great smiles we see on their faces, the fact that they keep coming back, the fact that the volunteers keep coming back, everyone seems to be benefiting from it and really enjoying the, the, the services that we're providing. This being my second year um, as the coordinator and watching the growth from the participants and seeing them come back each year um, as well as the volunteers because we do have volunteers that have been here um, quarter after quarter and they always request the same uh, participant and so they have such a great relationship and to see the excitement when the participants come and, and just that relationship grow as well as their skills um, for why they're coming here um, improve is a great neat thing to see throughout the years. Once you see the warmth of the kids smile and understand that that's a genuine feeling, it's not something that they're fronting or that you know that you don't want to be there. It's one of those that they make it, they, they make it the wholesome experience as the kids and definitely the way they act and they see you. It's so worth it, like I just, I feel so much gratification from it and it makes me feel good that I'm doing this because I love it 
and I get to see like how much they get to grow and how much I got to help them. And it impact the, the OSU students and everyone. They just love Brian for who he is in that moment. And when he's here, he's okay. You know, he is loved for who he is. He's not asked to be anything other than who he is. And they love him for just that. And that's just the best. I mean, I just, he's at peace here and he's happy here. And that means the world to us. One of our goals is to make sure that children with disabilities are included in community physical activity settings where they're not typically at the moment. So our goal is to increase links with local soccer programs, local kids clubs, um, local community organisations so that kids with disabilities are involved with programming. And one of the things we've done is set up relationship with the Boys and Girls Club so children with disabilities are integrated through that organisation. We also have a program called Impact for Life which is for adults who have transitioned through the Impact program for 21 and older and it's a, it's a community based physical activity program to help them become independently active once they're living out in the community. People with disabilities have less access to being physically active so one of the goals of the Impact for Life program is to be able to involve them in a structured program so that they can learn the skills to become independently active across the lifetime. So we have a long history of having a great impact on the lives of children with disabilities and preparing future professionals to work with um, individuals as they move out once they've graduated from OSU. And our goal is to continue to having a great impact on the, the lives of individuals with disabilities and improving their lifelong health and well-being.